Zion Oil has been a part of many of North Dakota's communities for over a hundred years, and with the growing concern regarding methamphetamines in the area, they feel a responsibility to raise awareness of the drug's impact. We feel that it's very important to us as a corporation when we talk about living our values that also transcends into our communities where our employees work and live. And with this type of a social issue, we thought it was very important that we as a business take a stand and say, hey, we're here to help too. Each presentation costs from ten dollars to $12,000 to put on, a huge investment on their part. It's a necessary investment, one that we feel with that small amount of investment, it really goes a long way. The forum provides education for all members of the community. It encourages action for prevention, and it illustrates the epidemic on a national scale as well as a local scale. The key is awareness, awareness that the, the drug is out there, awareness on how critical it is on the prevention issue, and awareness how highly addictive the drug is. The collateral damage to a community is, is a huge impact, just to the tax dollar base. Law enforcement is constantly battling the issue, but, on it, but we really try to focus on, on the blight that methamphetamine has become on our society on a very personal level to where we're trying to spawn action on the part of this community to rise up and fight it every way possible. The primary focus is prevention because according to Hill, the recovery rate for users and addicts is extremely low. I was uh, basically oblivious to the magnitude of the problem until I did the research and I think I can't be the only one. And so the essence of the message is, hey everyone, there's a big problem in your community. A problem that can hopefully have solutions as long as the issue is exposed through the establishment of a community dialogue. After reading over 2,000 books in only four weeks during reading month, the kids at St. Joe's took a break from school to have a little fun. We just get to sort of party the afternoon away. <laughs> this year's um, theme was Mission Briefcase Somewhere in the States. And all the teachers got clues and every week the kids had to answer the clues and travel. Actually, they were flying around the country, visiting states and learning about them. We uh, went to 40 states and ended up in Hawaii. So this is why we chose our theme as the Luau. We get to do games, um, make food, um, bingo. Plus it, um, plus it means we reached our goal and we've never um, failed before. It's really fun. We don't have to do much work, so that's really the upside of all of it. We get to play bingo and we get to spend the afternoon with our prayer partners and the rest of the school. It's a real um, morale booster for the kids because they work so hard to read, which is the most important thing.